Hi, I am Dr. Rajiv Kumar and I am a cancer surgeon working at Rajiv Gandhi Cancer Institute, Rohini, Delhi. And all of you know that breast cancer is the commonest cancer in Indian women. How does this cancer appears in our body? The most common presentation is that of a lump, breast lump. It starts with a very small lump and gradually it increases in size. Painless lump is more dangerous than a painful lump. So all painless lumps should undergo some investigations to find out whether they are malignant or not. The whole idea of doing investigation is to rule out malignancy. And one should be reassured that 80% of these lumps may not be cancerous. That is all the more important to find out whether your lump is malignant or not. So once you feel any lump in your body, in your breast, by the way of routine examination, what we call as breast self-examination, which should be done by every lady above the age of 30, 35 years of age. At the same time in the month, and palpating both the breasts, and if they found anything abnormal, they should report to the doctor. During pregnancy or just after pregnancy with breast lumps, so one should be very careful about these lumps. Anything abnormal you feel in the breast, any asymmetry, that means the both breasts are not equal or similar in their feel and touch and everything, then please consult a doctor. Another thing which is important in breast cancer, sometimes patients present only lump in the axilla, in your armpit. So that can also be breast cancer. Rarely in the late cases, patients present with some ulcers in the, on the breast, sometimes big swelling in the breast, sometimes some orange-like skin, what we call a puny orange. So these are all the symptoms of the breast cancer. Rarely, patients also present with some nipple discharge, like blood discharge from the nipple. So these are the initial symptoms of breast cancer. Of course, when it is advanced, it can produce any symptom, like pain in abdomen, uh, cough, hemoptysis, that means blood in your uh, cough or some uh, mental disturbances. That are the symptoms of bone pain. These are the symptoms of advanced disease.